everyone welcome to another video my name is Sanjay Prakash and today I will tell you about how we can use confirm box or confirm dialog box in model driven apps using power FX while working with command buttons you may write power FX to uh, you know uh, in the command button to achieve some requirement or to do some business process so like that this class or this video i will explain you how to write the confirm box in the power fx using command button let me open the model driven app i have a model driven app this one so i want to edit this so, so i am in the solution and i want to edit this model driven app when you edit the model driven app uh, the model driven app will open in the modern designer where i can edit the modern command designer right command button now i want to add a button on the student form so what i can do i can go to pages and click on this uh, page student page and click on these three dots and click on edit command bar i want to have a command button on the main form of the student so click on the main form and click on edit and when i add the button command button on the main form when someone click that button i want to delete the record and before deleting record it should take a confirmation from the user that whether he is confirming or the user is confirming to delete the record or not if he uh, clicks ok then it will delete otherwise it will not do or it will not delete right so before deleting or before doing anything you can think of updating record deleting record creating record so if you want to take a confirmation from the user you can use this power fx this is only used for model driven app at this moment for model driven app commanding but in canvas app it is not used at this moment well let us go and create that let me add a command button click on new command now the command will be added here in the command bar i can give a name here let's say remove and i want to use an icon an icon can be let's say abandon for example like this remove so now here i can write the power fx right so what the power fx i can write i can write a condition if what i want to do first i need to write the logical test right because i want to write a logical test uh, to take the confirmation from the user so i can use the first parameter is confirm so use confirm and confirm parameter confirm power fx power fx takes two parameter one is you can take one or multiple parameters the first one is message what message you want to display the message let's the message let's say it will be are you sure to delete the student record so it will display this message and after this string you can add more information like title of the confirmation box subtitle of the confirmation box and that should be done through json format right so you have to write down title and you can specify title let's say uh, confirmation confirmation box okay and by giving comma you can add subtitle right what subtitle you want to place here please confirm if you really want to delete the record from dataverse okay now the the confirm uh, power fx is completed for me now i have to define what if the uh, confirm is uh, the confirm box is clicked okay by the user because confirm box will display two buttons one is okay and another is cancel if user will click okay what uh, the code will do and if the cancel button is clicked what you want to do so click comma so give comma after confirm box and you have to write down the uh, functionality what 
you want to do if the confirm box returns true that means when the ok button is clicked from the user what i want to do i want to remove so write down remove remove is a power effects which can be used to delete a uh, record remove function requires two parameters first is the collection or the entity name plural name and next is the which item you want to delete i want to use self dot selected dot item right so this selected dot item will delete from the student entity right now what will happen if you don't want to if cancel is clicked now i want to just notify let me just uh, scroll this so that you can see it correctly i want to just notify operation cancelled okay and close the if bracket you understand what i have done the first line is the logic logical expression to return true or false and second parameter to execute when the um, logical statement returns true and the third one is the statement which will execute if the logical statement returns false you can also add multiple uh, power fx using semicolon let me use semicolon i want to navigate once it is deleted i want to navigate to student view then i can use navigate to student and in that uh, in that student's view it will display a notification like student deleted that much so what will happen the first line if condition will check if the confirmation is captured from the user if it is captured it will delete the student and navigate to students view and notify student deleted else it will display operation cancelled now my power effects is done what i can do i can click on save and publish every time you need to save and publish your command bar editings and once it is save and published you have to publish the model driven app also so once it is published i will go to the model uh, model driven app in designer mode and publish that also let us wait for some seconds so most of it is not about uh, removing uh, logic right you can write uh, patch logic update logic any logic create logic right so if you want to create a new record and you want to take confirmation from the user also you can do that here now it is published i can go to the uh, modern app designer model driven app designer and click on publish so two times you have to publish one is uh, command bar publish and the uh, model driven app publish once you have published you have to test it let us test this click on play or you can open the model driven app from your uh, power app section there is no no problem you just need to open the model driven app to test this right so open click on the play it will open the model driven app now let me go to student open any student let me open this now see it is telling this app is currently being upgraded updated with a newer version to place press control f5 so that it will reload the fresh data from the server let me open a record let me open this record lip kumar and if i will open this record i will find a button command button called as remove and this is the button right so when i click this remove it will immediately show me some message something went wrong please try to restart the app okay please restart this app sometimes it will not work otherwise if it is not published correctly now click on remove now you see whenever you clicked the remove command button it is displaying the confirmation box title and the subtitle please confirm if you are really wants to delete the record from dataverse 
and also the message are you sure you want to delete the student record now if you click cancel it will display a message operation cancel you see at the top now if you click on ok what it will do it will delete the record and it will redirect it to students view you see the students view is redirected and also it is displaying student is deleted right now you understand how to write the power fx uh, using confirm box and uh, doing the operation by taking confirmation from the user and also navigating to the specific view and notifying users thank you guys for your time watching this and uh, please subscribe this channel if you have not done i hope this will hope uh, this will help you in your project thank you see you bye